The Very Special Valentine by Christine Tagg, pictures by Maggie Neen. I need to find a valentine, says little bunny gray, to give to my friend Rosie on this very special day. Something bright and pretty to show how much I care, a present to remind her of the happy times we share. Is that a shiny bracelet strung with beads of purest gold? Look, says Squirrel Redtail, what a fine sight to behold. But no, they're tiny buttercups, each waiting to unfold. Are those glistening diamonds? What a fine gift they would make. Bunny reaches for them, but his paws begin to shake. There are dew drops on a spider's web, which Bunny dare not take. Look at the trickling water. I see precious stones that gleam. Then Swan calls from upon her nest, but are they what they seem? Now Bunny sees their pebbles sparkling in the stream. I see shining scarlet rubies sitting neatly in a line. Bunny thinks he's found a gift. For Rosie, they'd be fine. But then the little field mouse squeaks. These berries are all mine. I spy a shower of emeralds, a lovely green cascade. But look up in the sky, calls Fox, and Bunny's soon dismayed. For they are playful sunbeams dancing in the wooded glade. I see gleaming gems of amethyst with dancing purple light. Hoots the little owl wisely, that gift would be just right. But Bunny finds just blackberries beneath the soft moonlight. Looking up, young Bunny Gray asks the whispering trees, what can I give to Rosie to show what she means to me? But the trees don't give an answer. They just rustle in the breeze. I've searched in every corner, but no present can I find, cries Bunny Gray with great dismay. Says Rosie, Never mind. The gift of love within your heart is by far the sweetest kind. Nature is more beautiful than gold or jewels so rare. Each new day's a precious gift for everyone to share. Bunny Gray hugs Rosie to show how much he cares. Then paw in paw they scamper off, the happy bunny pair. The end.